Well, get ready to set sail on the hilarious high seas for the new comedy, Our Flag Means Death, starring Reese Darby as the 18th century pirate, Steed Bonnet. And trust us, it's a swashbuckling good time. <laughs> Take a look. Of course it's real. Look at it. Tatty edges. It's burnt. It's been around. It's seen things. If it were real, why would she have sold it to you? Why not keep the map herself and find the treasure herself? Oh, strong question. Love that. Well, maybe she's just lazy. I mean, she works down at the docks selling maps, for God's sake. Oh, and Reese joins us now. Welcome. So good to see you. Thank you. Nice to be here. Oh, my God. This show had me laughing out loud. It's so funny. And this is loose based on, like, the tr true story of the, f the relationship between St Steed and Blackbeard. So how loose is this <laughs> based on it? And what adventure does he go on? So it's over 300 years ago, so you know there's a lot of holes to fill uh, <laughs> yeah. with creativity. But it is a true story. This guy was uh, an aristocrat, a wealthy landowner, yeah. who read too many books and decided to uh, act out his fantasies. He didn't need to be a pirate. Most yeah. people become pirates because they have to be. Uh, this guy chose to uh, go for the adventure, and I I'd say it was a midlife crisis, really. Yeah, and everyone's trying to like give him an easy out. Like, not everybody's yeah. meant for exactly. this, which I love. Uh, but Steed is called, you know, like you said, he's a gentleman pirate, which in one episode I see he kind of names himself and likes yes. the sound of that because, like you said, he was wealthy. He didn't have to do this. But what kind of things is he trying to teach the other pirates? So just simple things like sharing, getting along, <laughs> yeah. and then uh, manners <laughs> and things that were really the skills that Steed has, which isn't, isn't much, to be honest. Uh, looking yeah. good, you know, and, and confidence yes. through uh, the art of talk. Yes, sharing your feelings. Yeah. Talking things through. Well, you and Taika, who plays Blackbeard, you're actually friends in real life. So when you're doing these, I can only imagine how many takes there are of yeah. these scenes, because it's ridiculous. I mean, th these scenes are so ridiculous. Do you get through it in your professional, or do you laugh through? Of course. Through? We, you know, we've been working together for a long time, but yeah. we do like to do a lot of takes, and we yeah. like to improve each time. We like to drop in new ideas and see a, see where we can really take the comedy. Um, so, of course, you're up against the clock. So yeah. we we manage to. Uh, get away with it and uh, I guess one of our skills is the ability to not laugh when you know you're really <laughs> yeah. laughing on the inside. Yeah that's hard um, but you know as funny as it is it's actually an interesting story too with this friendship between these characters. Mm. What intrigued you about telling this story? Because it hadn't been told really yeah. and I think uh, it's the yin and the yang they kind of needed each other. One was a, a terrible pirate who'd, who was sick of his life and the other guy was sick of his life for all the other reasons you know yeah. he had everything and he wanted to feel something he, he was uh, so that's why he um, went into piracy and yeah they just met and they had this uh, friendship and it's, it's something that we need to kind of explore yeah. and obviously it's ridiculous. It so is. In the best way possible. Yeah. And the, and the production is top notch, I have to say. And I have to, I, I love the costumes. How long does it take to get in, in the, the costumes, the hair, the yeah. get up? So Christine Wada is the uh, costume designer, and a lot of the items, most of my stuff was all handmade. Oh and my gosh. it was extravagant. I loved wearing it. Basically, uh, as soon as I put the high heeled shoes on, I mean, I am that guy. That's me. I'm yeah. Steed. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. There's a little bit of Steed in all of us. Yes. And when you wear that kind of stuff, you, you do feel confident. You sure do. Why do you think I'm wearing these? Amazing. Those shoes. Wow. <laughs> they make me feel yeah. confident. Um, but you've had some great guest stars on two of you. Who have been your favorites so far? Well, they've all been fantastic. Yeah. Um, I'm a big fan of all of the people we've had. Uh, I particularly like Will Arnett. Um, so and good. So, yeah, it was great working with him. Fred Armisen, uh, Leslie Jones, and, of course, my old friend Kristen Shaw, uh, Nick Kroll. Uh, I, mean, I mean, the, the list goes the on. The list goes on and on. I mean, on. they're just fantastic comic improvisers. Yeah. So, yeah, it was, it was a real treat. And you and Taika are so good together. You're working on another project, mm -hmm. which is uh, Next School Wins. It's also based on a true story, right? Yeah, we like uh, taking true stories and... Uh, Flipping them on their head. Well, the thing is, most, the best stories have got a bit of truth to them, yeah. you know, and so they're so crazy that they have to be told. Yes. And there's so much more fun to tell because, you know, these things happen in real life. So that was amazing. That, the, these guys got beaten 31-0 uh, 
uh, the biggest loss in, in international soccer, the American Samoan team in 2001. So this is the story of them actually getting better. There was a coach that came all the way down to the South Pacific. Oh, I like it. And he trained them to uh, be able to maybe get a goal. Yeah, I love an underdog story <laughs> and was, so do the yeah. rest of us. So we look forward to that. And in the meantime, you can catch Our Flag Means Death streaming on HBO Max now with new episodes every Thursday. Do yourself a favor and have a laugh. Reese, thank you so much. Thank you. Yep.